Hi, I'm Volkanet Mezer. In this video, I'm going to talk about Vertigo shoots on Crane 2, Smooth 4, and Crane Plus. Vertigo effect is that the person or object in the frame stays in the same place in the frame, but the background is moves closer to camera or moves away from the camera. So hmm. how do we do that? Of course using a gimbal that ah. we can control the zoom. In other words, we need to have a hardware that we can zoom in fluently. First, let's look at the how to do Vertigo in z Crane 2. I will use 60 Mark II and 24 105F4L lens on Crane 2 while doing this. First, attach the thread ring ring on the zoom ring. Because this is ring elastic, it's very important to install it firmly. In this way, the thread will not turn empty. Then attach the plate. Since the lens, I use it heavy lens. The center of gravity will remain in the front of the camera. To ensure stability, screw the camera as far back as possible on the plate. After screwing the lower part of the support rod onto the crane too, tighten the light support piece firmly onto the fixed part. Place the camera on crane too. You can compress it at a random point right now. Secrete the follow focus mechanism into the support rod so that the threaded are fully engaged. Then perform the standard balance settings step to balance. Let me give you a hint here. The lens you use will zoom. Do not forget this. So the lenses inside will move. The center of gravity will change. Set the lenses to about 70mm to compensate for the 24-105 lens. Then be sure to provide the entry balance. Connect one cable from mechanical follow focus to crane 2. Connect the other cable from the mechanical follow focus to your camera. Recheck the balance settings with all cables connected. When you zoom in, the camera will fall forward. The camera will fall back when you zoom out. But Crane 2 will balance it. Check the rotation of the rig by turning it by hand. In the next step, we need to determine the limits of the follow focus system. So we were going to set point A and B. If we don't determine at this point, the thread will jump and vibrate. To do this, first check the version of the mechanical follow focus you are using. If you are using an older version, you will not be able to set A and B point. Mechanical follow focus firmware needs to be version 1.70. Now, select well from the menu, then select the A and B point. Turn the well and mark by pressing the right button where the point A starts. Then turn the well again to mark the point where B ends by pressing the right button. So we have set the boundaries. You can now easily zoom in and out. Let's start practicing now. When you walk forward, if you make zoom in, it's wrong. When you walk backwards, if you make zoom out, it's wrong again. If you want the background to move away, you need to zoom out by walking forward, just like this. If you want the background to move closer, you need to zoom in as you walk backwards, just like this. Now let's do a vertigo effect on Crane Plus. As you know, Crane Plus has no follow focus mechanism. Therefore, vertigo effect cannot be performed on Crane Plus. However, you can buy a follow focus system to make vertigo effect. I use the follow focus model PD Movie Lab Air because it's wires. It's extremely easy to connect and use. You just need to buy the sports bar as an extra because you don't have it in the package. 
I'm going to use 80D and 1855mm lens. First, attach a thread ring ring on the zoom ring. Because this ring is elastic, it's very important to install it firmly. In this way, the thread it will not return to empty. Insert the sports screw into the flash slate on the camera and tighten the screw. Then insert the support bar and fully tighten the screw. Place the follow focus mechanism on the support bar. Make sure the thread rig are fully steep. Then tighten the screw firmly. Check the thread rate by turning the zoom ring. Then adjusting the balance of the crane plus, move the lens to the center point. Adjust the balance with the center of millimeter of the lens. The camera will fall forward when you zoom in. The camera will fall back when you zoom out. When the stabilizer is turned on, will stabilize itself during the zoom in out. Mount the control on the handle to make it easy to use. To establish the connection, insert the battery in the follow fox mechanism. The mechanism will open automatically. Turn on the controller after the light returns to white. Just like crane 2, we need to set point A and B. So we need to specify the limits that the well must turn. One press and continuous press the on off switch. Mechanical parts A and B will determine the point itself automatically. Crane Plus is ready for the vertigo. Let's start practicing now. When you walk backwards, if you make zoom out, it's wrong. When you walk forward, if you make zoom in, it's wrong again. If you want the background move closer, you need to zoom in as you walk backwards. Just like this. If you want the background to move away, you will need to zoom out by walking forward, just like this. Finally, make the vertigo effect in Zoom Smooth 4. You can do vertigo effect using Zoom Play app or Filmic Pro. After turning on your phone's Bluetooth, open Zoom Play app. Press Place Connect Device button. Select your Smooth 4 device. Make sure the Bluetooth icon on the top of the LED is blue. Press the Well Change button on the Smooth 4. You can zoom in or zoom out now. After turning on your phone's Bluetooth, open Filming Pro. Press the Settings icon at the bottom right. From the pop-up window, press Hardware and select Smooth 4. Press the Well Change button on Smooth 4. You can zoom in or out now. Let's start practicing now. When you walk forward, if you make zoom in, It's wrong. When you walk backwards, if you make zoom out, it's wrong again. If you want the background move closer, you need to zoom in as you walk backwards, just like this. If you want the background to move away, you need to zoom out while walking forward, just like this. So you have now learned how to make a vertigo effect on all Zeon products. Don't forget to share your videos in Zeon Light Collector. In this video you have seen how to make vertigo effects on Crane 2, Smooth 4 and Crane Plus. Don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel. And see you in the next video. Bye.